This is Pui's condo. The car there on the end is hers. This is the visitor's parking lot. There's underground parking too. As you can see, it's quite a tall building. Pui's condo is on the fifth floor, which is the first full-size floor of condominiums. This is the main entrance way here, with the drive up for dropping off of passengers right there. You go up the stairs, and there's the main entrance. This is main entrance from the other side. In the background there, you can see Pui with a white purse. And there's the river. As you can see, this building is right on the river. The river flows from right to left. Uh, to the left is the sea, to the right is the rest of Thailand. One thing we were wondering about is whether or not the building would allow pets. It would seem that the answer is yes. That is where the pool is. I got some pictures of the pool, but nothing I could put on the video. It's actually above the sign right there. It's a nice pool, but uh, the video I have doesn't show anything except just a sliver of water. The rest of it shows mostly this view. And there's the pier, in case any of my buddies want to swing by in a powerboat and pick me up and go for a night in the river. This is the view stepping off on the fifth floor right off the elevators. There's this open view looking right on to downtown Bangkok. Bangkok just goes on and on. It's got more tall buildings spread out all over than you can shake a stick at. This is the entrance to the condominium. We just came in through the front door. And the kitchen is to the right. Here it is. There's no oven. There's a hot plate for cooking, frying stuff up, but there's no oven for baking. They don't bake much in Thailand. Nice, long, spacious kitchen, dining room, living room. And there we are. We're looking back. That area right there by the front door is where you take your shoes off. The door to the left is a guest bath, which I didn't get any good footage of. And here's a guest room. And this is the master bedroom. And there's a hallway that leads to a huge walk-in closet and the master bath. Here's the walk-in closet. Oh, now there's a handsome guy. What a videographer. Here's the bathroom. I didn't do so good a job of capturing the stuff here, but oh well. It's a bathroom. That box on the ceiling up ahead is the air conditioner for this room. All the air conditioners are long thin units stuck up near the ceiling like that. Now we're going to step back into the guest bedroom.
queen her sister did all the decorating and picked out the art and everything for this place. And they did a really good job. And now the view out the window is that of the river. That's looking uh, upland. And those down there are the external components of the air conditioners. It's not a huge uh, porch that you can see there. There's another one outside the main living room area that's quite a bit bigger. Room for chairs and a small table. Or plants. And here I just zoom across the river and you can see that there's a lot of industry directly across. But that seems to be waning in favor of more uh, commercial uses and residential uses. And that's the hotel next door. Apparently they have a pretty good restaurant.